Hello everyone, my name is Micah. Today we're going to be making a delicious cocktail called the Florida Margarita. I can't get enough of margaritas right now, and so I thought I'd share this one with you. It is a little bit complicated where we do have quite a few ingredients, but the way they come together is really a beautiful thing, and I think you're going to enjoy it. So, let's make this drink. First thing we need is to grab a shaker glass. We're going to put all our ingredients right into here and we're going to shake this up and pour it into a nice cocktail cup glass. So for this, what we're going to do is we're going to add in a little bit of sweetener. So we're going to add in some simple syrup. Simple syrup is exactly what it sounds. It's simple to make. It's equal parts of hot water and sugar, which is going to blend together and give us a really nice sort of syrupy uh, liquid sugar. So we're going to add in half an ounce of simple syrup to start us off. And then what I'm also going to grab is some fresh squeezed grapefruit juice. And we're going to use an ounce and a half of grapefruit juice. And there we go. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to grab some bitters. I have some really nice orange bitters, which are going to give it a little aromatic, a little more complexity. And this is the Fees Brothers orange bitters, but you can use any sort of orange bitters that you have, and you can find them at any sort of uh, bartender supply store. So we're going to put two good dashes into our mix, and already I can smell the good flavors that are coming out of that just all together. And then we're going to need a lime wedge, and we're going to need one for a garnish as well. So we'll actually go ahead and cut some lime wedges. And depending on how juicy the lime is, we do need about three quarters of an ounce for our cocktail. So we're going to squeeze in two good juicy lime wedges and I find that's usually enough. And we'll use save the third to garnish with our drink. We've got our garnish ready as well and that will be set for when we're all finished. So now that we have that in here, we're going to grab some triple sec or an orange flavored liqueur. And we're going to add in half an ounce. I'm also going to grab some cranberry juice and just put in half an ounce of cranberry juice. Just gives a little bit of a rose color and balances out some more flavors. Then we're going to add in some tequila and I've used 100% Hornitos Reposado tequila, a rested tequila that will add much more flavor to your drinks when you're using it. So I'm going to do this a little bit of style as well. And we'll put in an ounce and a half into our mix. Now we're going to add some ice. And we're going to shake this up. Nice and mixed well together and chilled down. Then we want to strain this right into our old style cocktail glass. And finish it off with our garnish. And there you have it, our delicious Florida margarita. You can also have a salt rim on here if you choose, but I find it's just fine just without it. If you need other cocktails or to see For other cocktails, you can visit www.askmybartender.com or until next time, cheers.